Okay, so this is gonna be a first review on a new Think Geek and Formula foundation. Um, so this is what I picked up. This is called Physicians Formula Youthful Wear Cosmological Youth Boosting Spotless Foundation and Brush. And basically, the reason why I bought this product, and it's not because I heard about it or read about it or anything, but basically because of this little brush that it came with, um, I think what this product is trying to mimic is the new Bare Minerals foundation, which comes with the little brush that has a little hole in it or like a little cutout that you can squeeze the foundation into. And I'm pretty sure that that's what this is trying to be. So I went and picked it up because I was really curious to see how well this actually performs as a foundation. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and open it up for you guys. And I haven't opened it yet. This is why it's a first review. And pull it out here. So basically you have a foundation and the foundation has like a little squeezy dropper. Oh my goodness. Yeah, so it's a dropper basically. And you use the dropper to drop the foundation onto the brush. And here is the brush. Oh, bummer. It doesn't have the little hole that the Bare Minerals one does. But basically, the Bare Minerals brush looks exactly like this. Like, exactly like this as far as the shape. It's black. It's not the same color. And it's a longer handle. This is a much shorter handle. The bristles are black. And it's got a slight angle, like the tiniest angle. But as you can see, the top is completely bent and full. It's not like the Bare Minerals brush that has... A hole and you squeeze it in and then you swirl it so that's kind of a bummer because I was kind of hoping it could be like a wannabe bare minerals dupe but it's not but we'll see because the foundation might actually work well now before I try the product on I just want to read a little bit of the claims that the back of the box says that it has so this breakthrough this breakthrough Foundation formula has skin perfection ultra fluid foundation delivers flawless spotless coverage and a finish so natural it looks invisible in the sun. 35% silicone formula and true color pigments create a revolutionary weightless liquid deal that feels as if you have no makeup on. That's good. That sounds exactly what the that sounds exactly like what the bare minerals new liquid foundation was trying to do say goodbye to spots powerful brightening cosmological cosmic no powerful brightening cosmic cuticle ingredients help improve the appearance of dark spots age spots and sun spots instantly over time formulated with spotless technology okay it's basically just telling me it's a to help remove spots. It's all about spots. Youthful wear, I guess. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. So let me just make sure that there's no... Oh, see, so right there it shows you that this is the dipper. And that is the Pro Foundation brush. I should have seen that before. Okay, so let's get into it. Um, I don't have a mirror in front of me. I'm looking straight into my Kindle right now. So, sorry about that, but basically, I'm going to go ahead and try this. Now, they only had two colors there. This is for, like, is it medium? This is medium, so it's probably going to be way too light for me because I'm very dark because it's summertime, and I'm actually a lot paler than this, which is crazy. So, this is going to not fit me at all. I was well aware of this fact when I bought this, but I wanted to try it anyways. And I figure if I really like it, then I could always wear it in the winter when my skin is a lot lighter. But yeah, okay, so let's try it out now. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my little brush. And I'm going to take the dropper. This is like an experiment or something. Like This is way too messy. I'm going to put in a couple of drops. <laughs> okay, like one and a half drops. Hold on. Alright, that's two drops. Okay. Um, 
really really <laughs> yeah I'm gonna need a lot more drops of that to the top of here we go Here we go, on my own. Oh, there we go, that's a little better. The brush is really hard. Like, I thought it was gonna be a lot softer pressing into my skin, but it's actually a little hard. It kinda hurts a little. Um, so use a light hand. Um, <laughs> well, I will say that I got a cool little brush out of this thing, so if I don't end up loving the formula or loving the whole product overall. I guess I have a little brush that I can use in the future for buffing little tiny things in my face. I don't, I don't know. Oh, you know what? This actually would be really good for cutting out like a really sharp contour line. Yeah, okay. So, oh my God. So first impression, hmm. Before I conclude my first impression, I'm gonna look in the mirror and see how this finish looks. Okay, so I just finished applying the foundation to my face and I looked in the mirror this time while I finished applying it so I can get a better look at how it goes on and how it blends and if it's smooth and all that. So it's a very interesting formula. Um, it's very, very, very lightweight. They definitely, definitely got that right. Um, hmm, spotless. I guess it helped even out my skin tone a little bit. It, 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 um, it sort of lessened the redness on this pimple, but you could still clearly see it. Um, but I guess that's not so bad for such a lightweight formula. Uh, I actually think that I really, really like it a lot. And I know I probably say that with like every product that I ever talk about on camera. But honestly, the reason why I think I'm going to really like this formula is because A, it's not as light as I thought it was going to be for me. So that is going to be awesome. Um, B, it goes on... Okay, I already said that, but it goes on so light. Like, I thought it was going to be, like, way more thick for some reason. But basically, it goes on... It's like a serum. It's like an oily type of foundation that's highly pigmented. Um, so it's, like, it's kind of feels oily or greasy at first. Like, when you're first putting it on, it definitely feels like a serum. And if you can see, it leaves behind a little bit of the pigmentation once the oil has been absorbed into your skin. And so I think that this little buffer brush is great for being able to blend out that leftover pigmentation that stays on your skin. So I actually like it a lot. I don't know if I would call it like a full on foundation. I feel like this is more of what a BB cream should be. Um, just because I find that BB creams are like, sometimes they're thicker and crazier than like a real foundation, which is crazy. But yeah, sorry, my dog's barking. But yeah, it feels really lightweight. It um, it felt a little oily going on, but like I said, once you buff it away, the oil feeling goes away, and you're left with like a soft kind of a finish. Um, so I like it a lot, but I feel like if you want full coverage, you might want to layer another foundation over this, or put powder over this, or layer something else. Like this alone is definitely definitely not gonna get you full coverage at all but for light coverage maybe medium i don't even know if this will push medium coverage but for light coverage i think it works great i mean this is a perfect perfect foundation for the summer i just absolutely love it i think it's perfect i'm so glad that i'm gonna be able to use it that it's not too light for me and if there's a darker color that comes out i'll probably get the darker one too just to like make sure that i have the perfect color this is a great drugstore foundation i'm really glad that i kind of paid the extra money for it so there you go that is my first impression of the new physician's formula youthful wear foundation Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for more videos. And I know it's been 
like half a year since I've done videos, but what can I say? I'm a new mom. You have to forgive me, right? Um, so stay tuned for more videos, and if you haven't already, please subscribe, leave me some comments, show me some love, like my video, spread the love, and I'll talk to everybody later. Bye!